Hello, Sherry. Happy birthday. Here is your top 10 things that I love about Sherry and memories that I have of you and I together. So here we go with our top 10 memories. Coming in at number one. Going to Long Beach. What? We have so much fun. We used to have so much fun going to Long Beach and going on the boardwalk and out on the beach walking in the mornings. We're always walking too fast for the guys to stay caught up anyway, having great memories. And then, of course, there was always the biking incident. Eh, luckily, nobody caught good footage of that. And that story can just remain between the three of us. Coming in at number two on the list is just campfires and good company. I do not even know how many times we've sat around the campfire, either celebrating somebody's retirement, somebody's birthday, or just because, but I love all those campfire conversations. And so here we are at a number of different events where I'm pretty sure there were campfires involved. Coming in at number three. Mishaps with tequila. This could be responsible for like five or six pages all by itself, but you know, there were times we could blame Ruben or Brian for our incidents, like the grapefruit tequila night. Oh boy. When everybody ended up taking a nap except for one person, I think. Um, there was the time, of course, that you looked at infused tequila and thought that's good enough. And so we pretty much drank straight tequila slushies, some of us more than others. And then, of course, there's the most recent incident in which you flipped the drink right out of the bartender's hand. And that was just a week ago. Yes, mishaps with tequila would be at top of our list. Number four, coming in at number four. San Diego, soft spot in, spot in my heart for all of our San Diego adventures. Love the good drinks we had and the times on the beach. Also remember a guy ODing right in front of our very eyes or coming close to it. Yes, because no matter where we go, things like that happen. Coming in at number five, we've got just margarita nights in general. I don't even know how many times we've met, but for a while it was once a week, and now it's a little bit more sporadic, but a good tequila night, a good margarita night has been had many times with many different um, collections of people. We always have a good conversation and walk away feeling better. Coming in at number six. All kinds of miscellaneous stuff that I couldn't think of a way to categorize, but Everything from our last drive in that Razor on your new, brand new property. I've now known you through three homes. That was fun. Margarita always. And I think this is a Safeco field when you guys came to support our family, as always. At number seven, river rafting trips. There are so many images and video clips that I could share of river rafting. I couldn't pick, but... I thank your family for inviting our family and providing a decade or more of memories of just good, clean, like family time with so many good people. And I can't even tell you how many river rafting memories I have. And now there's rattlesnakes involved too. <laughs> Coming in at number eight, that banana boat. It's just a you and I time. And I love the banana boat adventures that we've had together. Um, and our last kayaking, uh, some of our kayaking adventures as well. Coming in at number nine, we have New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve for a few years. Um, we've been all together and how much fun has that been um, until you met your new best friend in the bathroom stall. There she is. Yes. Who can forget? Who could possibly forget your um, friend? Yes. Hmm. And then at number 10, just your friendship and our family's friendships together and all the different things that we've done together. Uh, the memories are priceless. My friendship with you um, 
is just invaluable to me. So I thank you so much and happiest of birthdays to somebody who understands me just the way I am. And I love you for it. Thank you so much and love you.